What is up, everybody? It's your boy Italian Stallion 1 back in the building today with some Star Wars Battlefront for you guys. First look at the online, well, at least on my YouTube channel, it is. Um, sorry I haven't posted a video in a while. Real life stuff has just been madness. Uh, and honestly, I've been focusing a lot more, uh, on my Twitch stream, and in doing so, I kind of neglected my YouTube channel. So I'm trying now to definitely make time for both. I don't want to forget about YouTube. I do enjoy making videos, and I love streaming. Um, if you guys haven't checked out my stream, it's the same name as above. Italian Stallion 1. I stream every morning about 9, 10 o'clock Mountain Standard Time, AM, and then about the same in the evening, 9, 10 o'clock. So if you guys want to come by, drop a little heart, you know, follow. I appreciate it. You guys' support has been phenomenal thus far, and I appreciate it. So, here's Star Wars. We are going to hop into... Just an online multiplayer game, let you guys get a little, you know, feel for it. Uh, Blast is like the regular TDM, more or less. So, we're gonna hop into that. Just basic. You have the other game modes. You have ones that have vehicles available. You have ones that have heroes available. Uh, heroes being like, you know, you could be a Jedi or like Princess Leia. Uh, I, this game is just amazing. I can't say enough good about this game. Um... I also have Black Ops 3, so, you know, I will make a couple videos on that. It, to me, it was a bigger letdown than it was, like, ooh, this game's awesome. I love the graphics and stuff, but it's, like, the same nonsense again. You know, people, oh, you got wall running, you got, you know, jetpacks, but the new play style of Call of Duty is to sit there and aim down your sights for ten minutes. Like, it's just, it's almost not even fun anymore. This, on the other hand, is very much fun. There's just so much to do. The missions that you could do by yourself. You could even do uh, co-op missions, which is really awesome. You could do it with a friend. Um, and then you have the online mode, of course. You have survival mode, where you can go through doing waves of stormtroopers and stuff. That's pretty cool, too, as well. See, I mean, and these maps are just... Man, you won't get this on Call of Duty. These maps are amazing. Oops. Damn it, they're running away from me. Where is he? Oh, wow. I got ambushed from three different directions. And don't forget, man, if you guys like the video, please, by all means, go ahead and click the like button. Which I'm sure you will, because this game is just purely amazing. And if you're not a subscriber, subscribe to this channel as well, please. I do appreciate the support, and our fan base is getting pretty, you know, pretty decent now, so I would like to keep that momentum going. Uh, I am going to be doing 100 subscriber giveaway with Dimples, probably within the next couple days here, as well as Hidden Paradise number 6 with Dimples. So we have, we have a bunch coming, man. I'm going to be trying to do daily videos now, um, keep up with the streaming that I do, so dang, I'm getting my butt kicked right now. Yeah, if you just look around, though, they put a lot into this, man. They put a real lot into this, and I love it. I would say that people play this for a lot more fun than they do, like, you know, Call of Duty, everybody's trying to get a good KD, or trying to be the next MLG player. And here, it's just about, hey, let's, let's do this, you know, let's win this game, and let's just have fun. Now, if they did do a competitive aspect, I wouldn't mind that either. I would totally be cool with that. But, where it stands, the game is just... It's meant to be fun. There's nothing better than waking up in the morning and having the sound of blasters in the headphones. The sound effects are probably half the best part, you know? Especially when you're flying and stuff. They have uh, the one online mode that's aerial assault or whatever. And it's just pure uh, aer aerial battle. You're in, you know, if you're on the dark side, then you... Oh, that was a really quick game. So we'll probably do another one. I must have got in halfway. But anyway, back to what I was saying. If you're on the uh, dark side, you get to be in either the TIE Fighter or... What was the other one? The TIE... Something. There's another choice. God, what was it? The name's escaping me. And then if you're on the, the Rebel side, of course, you have the X-Wing and the A-Wing. Golly, why can I not remember the name of that other... I can see it in my head. I just can't think of what the heck it's called. Maybe it's Enforcer? Maybe I'm crazy? Um, I can't remember. 
Right, let me switch this grenade real quick. There we go. Oh, now we gotta wait. <laughs> of course. This is actually a cool map, too. On some of them, you see, like, the local people running around, little Jawas or little Ewoks will be throwing rocks at you on Endor. Um, there, there's really cool things that happen in this game, and it's, like I said, tons of fun. There's really no negative. I mean, I have suggestions that, to me, would make it a little cooler, but there's no negatives to the game, in my opinion. Or at least none that I've found. Everything seems spot on. Dang it. See, look at little Jawas. Watch this. I'll hide over here. Oh, come on, do it. <laughs> and then you can also, the best part is you can switch to third person. So you switch the third this way, this way. You can stay whatever side you like. I like to stay in first person to get the effect of, you know, looking down the blaster. But if they're playing, they have that as well. Because that's how, I don't know how many of you played the original Battlefronts, but that's how it was. Nikes. I knew I was going down. But of course, my head misses. Go figure. I got some pretty cool uh, blasters so far, though. We got like a little LMG dealie here. Let's check that out. See that guy up on the right. Where is he? Or what? Oh my goodness. Let me switch back here. They're all good guns though. There is no, like, attachments or anything like Call of Duty, which I honestly don't mind. Like I said, Call of Duty's been a big bust for me this year. They're going way too far in the future. They're starting to make it what, you know, Call of Duty never was. And, uh, I don't like it as much as I used to, that's for sure. Watch this. Oh! What happened, buddy? What happened? Oh, really? Come on. I need to get some kills. Some of these maps, like, you really have to learn. I've, I've still only had it for, like, a day. Um, but they're tricky, man. There's a lot of different ways to go. Different high level, low level stuff, so... Ah, I didn't mean to fall down. Ah, try to get away from one and run right into the other. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Well, of course they do. I'm getting my butt kicked. But it's not, like I said, it is, it's not, it's, who cares? It's fun regardless. Everybody likes to win, but if you don't, you still had a good battle along the way, you know?
Damn, his one shot blast from almost got me though. If he was a little bit closer, I'd have been dead. Ah! Oh. Got five kills, five kills. We can make a couple more happen here before the end of the round. Son of a gun. Some of these people, it's like, damn, how do you see that far, you know? Either that or they must just be on the sights a lot. Wow. Really? Really? Are you really? Are, are we really doing this now? That's one of the pickups. There's a bunch of them. I haven't even seen one to show you guys, but... Dang it, let me... How the hell did I get up there? Oh. I'm gonna find the right little rock. Almost had him. It's hard when you get pinned down by two, you know? So yeah, look at it. Get a little droid. Oh my goodness. The high ground always is gonna win. They're just sitting there staring down at you. Try to get the hell out of here safely. Oh no, I did not so well on that round. But, at least you guys got to check it out. So, there you have it. Star Wars Battlefront. I will be making many more videos on this. I'll probably add some of Black Ops 3 and definitely some... I've been doing a lot of Forza Motorsport 6. Um, I'll be adding that as well. So, definitely look out for those. Like I said, if you liked the video, which I hope you did, it was a good time for me. Drop a like on the video for me. It lets me know that I'm doing my job well. Watch out for the new videos coming up this week. And also, check out the Twitch stream if you haven't. Stop by and check that out. I appreciate all your support. Thank you so much for everything you guys do. You guys are amazing. And we will see you guys next time. It's been your boy Italian Stallion 1. Checking out.